giant news last week. I got married. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Congratulations. Yeah, I know. Super crazy, like actually though. What was also crazy was I got married on a Friday and I also happened to have dropped a song. Poor planning or overly dedicated, maybe a little of both. Anyway, this week's song is called Clear and it's actually pretty crazy that this song is coming out. This song, which I'm gonna take you into the computer and show you how I made, this song was made before I met my wife. Like, way before. And it was it's basically talking about, essentially it's talking about the struggles of dating and it's talking about you know, struggling with a past relationship and all that stuff. The themes in here, it's crazy, like I've talked about this before. When I drop a song, it's generally a theme that isn't currently true in my life. It's something that I made a long, long time ago. However, this song is still relevant to other people, and so it's fine if I'm dropping it, and it's not currently relevant to me, but it's still relevant to other people. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get in here and show you this song. In my opinion, extremely smooth song and really unique arrangement. I always try to be unique with the arrangement, and uh, I'm going to talk a little bit more about the meaning. So let's hop into the computer, and then let's talk about the song. If you need any further proof that I got married... New coffee mug. It says Mr. on it. My wife has one that says Mrs. Exceptional wedding gift. Okay. Enough about coffee. Now on to the music. First thing I got here, little sample that I've got. Every time I play these samples, I always hear them and I'm like, vibe, vibe, vibe. Come on, bro. Listen to that vibe. Like... I love that vibe. Next thing I'll play you, I have to have a vocal sample. Dude, okay, you guys start, you must be starting to see a theme in my music. Like I love these vibey chords and a vocal sample. Check out the vocal sample. With the chords. Oh my God, so smooth. I have this other little synth instrument. The, these melodies all go together so well, you must admit, you must admit. Chorus. I'm gonna just solo out the vocals. The chorus, man, the vibes of the Vogue. I love the word vibes. If about a week and then you left, came into my life and took my breath, I must have told you some you didn't wanna hear. Got layers. I was trying to be crystal clear. Now we going back our separate ways. Wish you told me that you waste my time, I wouldn't waste a day Now I'm back on my hate on other couples As if you want to hear about my troubles, about my trouble Got deep vocal layers too If about a week and then you left Came into my life and took my breath I must have told you something you didn't want to hear I was trying to be crystal clear Now we going back our separate ways and Wish you told me that you waste why did I do it like that? Like I had one vocal layer, one, 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 oh God, octave, whatever. And then I was like, I want to throw these deeper vocals in here to add vibration almost. Almost like I'm adding a bass, but it's not a bass. It's just like my voice sort of modeling a bass with a lower octave. Then we've got some little ad libs, I call them. You can call them harmonies. I don't give a hoot what you call them. If about a week and then you left. Okay. Some you didn't want to hear. Yeah. I was trying to be crystal clear. Yeah. Now we go. I think to me that just adds so much extra vibe. So let, let's hear all of them and then I'm going to play it with the instrumental too. If about a week and then you left, came into my life and took my breath. I must have told you some you didn't want to hear. I was trying to be crystal clear. The drums with that now. So the way I did the drums, definitely wanted to be more unique. I have an 808 in here. Smooth 808. Let's go for choice of snare. I always like to point out kind of the way the snare is. Right? I think it's layered with a clap. Kind of has a clap in there too that I layered. Like a clap roll. Choice of snare, super important. Even if you're watching this right now, maybe you're not an artist or a music producer, you're just a genuine fan of mine, and you're like, look, I don't know about all this choice of snare, blah, blah, blah. Doesn't matter. 
take this, listen to other songs now. Like, go listen to music. You go, okay, what's that sound in other songs, and how much does that really set a tone? Every single instrument, the choice, the way it sounds, sets the tone for the song. So, one part of why I do these videos is for my for my fans out there who are not music creators to now appreciate music for more than just oh this song bumps like be intelligent and understand why like this is this is why uh, got some hi hats right and basically what I was trying to do with the hi hats the snare and the clap is have it all roll off of each other and then we got a kick it's got it just like It's got a groove to it with the 808. So, check out how the song comes in. How it goes from the first part of the chorus is like the vocals with no drums and how the drums come in. You was here for about a week and then you left Came into my life, into my breath I must have told you some you didn't want to hear I was trying to be crystal clear Now we going back our separate ways Wish you told me that you waste my time I wouldn't waste a day Now I'm back on my hand on other couples As if you want to hear about my troubles, about my troubles Chorus. Next part is the verse. I kind of did that more melodic rap. Hit you that I'm coming, then I pull up quick. Call you when I part outside, I put you on it is. Got this game for you, girl, you know I never miss. Using me to handle business, then I get dismissed. You probably didn't know that I wanted more. I've been in and out, had to go another route. Lately things been going south, need to know what you've been about. If it's early on, tell me all about your doubts. Anyway, that kind of gives you a sense of the vibe of how the song rolls into it. Second chorus, I'll kind of take you toward the end of it into the second verse. At the beginning of the video, I talked about how the arrangement's different. The second verse arrangement, different, different. But I'm gonna take you at the end of the hook. As if you wanna hear about my troubles, about my troubles. I'm gonna break down each instrument first. Ha, tease you. So, got a little reverse of the sample. So that was the original sample, I reversed it. Very Drake thing to do. A very Lazy the Gifted thing to do. <laughs> vocal sample. Same vocal sample, but I played different parts of it. And then I have another instrument come in, another like synthesized instrument. When I hear this, epic, moody, and I don't know why, but I see the Golden Gate Bridge. I see a gray, epic day in San Francisco with, 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 with just that vibe. Like, this is what I see in there. All the melodies. This is such a freaking, this is such a vibe. I went crazy. When I made this, I was just going crazy. Like, yeah, so the other thing I did, I'm going to solo out my vocal. I made the vocal a little bit more like distortion and warmth, a little bit like megaphone kind of effect. Been a minute since we kept in touch. I had some shit up on my mind and I kept you up. You would bless me up. We had this perfect system. We had this sacred rhythm. I worshiped your wisdom. Oh, so many. Then I have some doubles come in here at this next part. So many memories popping up so randomly. In the Thought background. Ever after happily. You used to be family. You fulfill my fantasies, but we let problems get in between us like nah. Being financially secure. And then just the themes that I'm talking about here, like, come on, bro. So let, let's hear that transition from the end of the chorus into this, because that's, to me, one of my favorite parts of any song that I've made. If you want to hear about my troubles, about my troubles. Been a minute since we kept in touch. Oh, I had some I shit up this. on my mind, and I kept you up. You know what? me up. We had this perfect system. We had this sacred rhythm. Different drums. I your wisdom. Oh, so many memories popping up so randomly. Thought we'd end up ever after happily. You used to be family. What? Flowing. And then into the next court hook. You was here for about a week and then you left. Change up the arrangement here Came as well. Into my life and to my breath. I must have told you some you didn't want to hear. I was trying to be crystal clear. Now we going back. I, said, I love breakdowns like this. So I made this song March 1st, 
2020. I made this song March 1st, 2020, long time ago, long time ago. And I worked on this song so many times. Like the first thing I did was I just had the chorus. I had the beat and the chorus. And I was like, that's all I had for literally months. And then I was like, all right, I'm gonna write the first verse. Then I wrote the second verse not too long after I wrote the first verse. All of that, all of that happened before I met my wife, which was August, we, we, we said the date was around August 11th or 12th, 2020. So I made this whole song before we even met. Crazy. I'm happy with this song because it's super relatable. It's so relatable. Like it's not something I'm going through anymore and I've talked about this in my videos before, but this is a song that's just relatable to people. It's about, honestly, it's just about the struggles of dating. It's like, it's what I was going through dating and then dealing with feelings, you know, from the past that obviously I'm over now, but I love the fact that my music can be a screenshot of something that happened in my life that can relate to other people. That's such a big reason and a big why for why I do music. It's so that I can relate to you. And that's why, like, I make music as a journal for myself, but I share the music so that you can relate to it as well and that you can feel something because, you know, as a peaceful leader, it's difficult to want to be doing big things and trying to be successful and hold on to romantic relationships and try to find some kind of balance with feeling secure in that area of your life. And, and, and I've gone through that, I deal with it. You know, I, luckily I'm at a point right now, I'm married, so that part of my life is, is, is handled in a much better way than it used to be, obviously by this song. And uh, I just want you to relate to this song as best you can. So here's the deal, if you're watching this right now and it's, the song hasn't dropped yet, the song's dropping this Friday, and if you are watching this and the song's already dropped, then click below, go go listen to it. Go listen to all my other music too. I'm putting out a brand new single every single week to end off 2021. So I appreciate you so much. And of course, subscribe to the YouTube channel, like the video, do all that good stuff, all right? Thank you so much for watching. And I'm gonna talk to you again next week. Peace. Now we going back our separate ways. Wish you told me that you waste my time. I wouldn't waste a day. Now I'm back on my hand on other couples. As if you wanna hear about my troubles, about my troubles.